Hello everyone, welcome to the channel of RD Technical Learning. So in this video, we are going to share an update regarding campus recruitment. So the two companies who have made an headline that they will not be going for campus hiring this year are Infosys and Wipro, right? So these are the two companies who will not be going for any hiring for the campus recruitment for this year. Every year, if you will see in the IT companies, what happens, the companies like TCS, Wipro, Infosys, Capgemini, Cognizant, these all companies go for campus hiring. During the campus hiring, the students who are studying in the seventh semester or who have uh, recently come into the sixth or seventh semester, they are, give, they are asked to give some aptitude test. So aptitude test, then group discussion, interviews, technical interviews and uh, you know the final HR interviews these are the various rounds on the basis of which the students who are studying in the colleges are given the jobs so they are given the offer letters right I'm not telling about joining letters right so these candidates these students will be selected and once they complete their degree they complete their graduation program then they will be given some joining date on that particular date they have to go and join that particular company right but this year two companies who have mentioned that they will not be doing any sort of uh, campus hiring are Infosys and Wipro right so generally what happens is uh, the students who are getting selected right so any student who gets selected they will be trained right irrespective of whether you are from electrical mechanical background if you are going into the IT industry you will be given basic training of softwares right you will be asked about you will be trained about programming languages right and once this training is completed then you will be assigned to some project if any project is and and in that project you will be getting built right if any project is not assigned to you then you would be put on bench but again you will be getting the project after some time on bench during the bench also you will be paid and uh, during that period you will be a part of that company itself right so you don't have to think that you are not paid but what what is happening is the companies will not be going for campus hiring which does not mean that none of the companies going so companies other companies like hcl tcs they have decided to carry on with their usual logistics right so that is a good point actually so apart from these two companies all the com other companies would be going for the campus recruitment right and this is the first time since 2008 that these companies have decided to not carry on with the campus placements right so as you can see the global economic slowdown is happening also the layoffs are happening in the us and outside india so this is the news that we have received if you will see the growth rate the the quarterly growth rate of infosys wipro so i think from infosys it is somewhere around six to seven percent for wipro it has declined to minus 0.1 percent right the overall the quarterly growth rate in infosys it is six to seven percent this year compared to last year which was nearly 14 to 16 percent right for Wipro, it has completely declined, which is actually a, not a good sign for both of these companies and also the employees who are a part of these company. So if any of you are looking for getting a job into these companies, then you can think and you can, uh, you know, look for other options also in the market, right? So uh, this would this was an update that I wanted to give it to you regarding the campus hiring, regarding the recent update that we have got from Infosys and Wipro. They will not be going for campus hiring in this particular year, right? Apart from that, if you will see the TCS, they have also launched the TCS Ninja program. They also have TCS NQT program and they are they have already started the conversations with the colleges for going for the campus hiring, right? So which is a good sign. So uh, that's it for this video. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, stay tuned for more updates. Thank you.